this is Dawn of Man. It has my attention. I've played some of this. Some of the way through. Been very interested in it. And uh, let's play it together. Into the, into the north. Mountains, frozen valley. Let's go on the frosty lake. Good name, Ugnir. Ugnir. So, Dawn of Man is a... It's a survival game. We are this tribal people. Before y'all wandering off, let's, uh, we have various metrics of which, easier if we group them by food, we have some meat that can be either raw or cured, we have fish, vegetables, some skins, we have lists of spears, there are many kinds. Let's go ahead and bring this over to the left. We have six people, we have capacity for six. You can fit three in each of these little huts. We know nothing, except that it is it is winter and it is cold. Well, it's actually not terribly cold for winter. It'll get colder. Get the alarm ready. So, we can do various things. Let's look at our surroundings. We have this lake. And there's some animals nearby. So this would be a nice little place to set up. We're here in the mountain, in the woods here. No, no clearings around. We'll work with what we've got. So one thing we want to do, we want to tell them to start fishing. Could use some flint. The camera's a little wonky to get used to. There's some flint, somebody go get that. In the meantime, let's... Let's have one of the kids go pick up sticks. Is it a little quiet? Let's go pick up some rocks. Where's fire? Just, you know, basic things you need to do. Now let's get some storage area for these. I'd like a place to put my sticks and I lied. I'll move this up here in just a wee bit. Place to put my six sticks and a place to put some rocks. So we, on here on the HUD we have we have build, planting, we don't know anything about that yet. We're macro managing. 
Various lists and metrics are here. How's our people doing? Prestige. By pressing tab or going to primal vision, it highlights everything that's interactable. Green animals, not so dangerous. Yellow animals would be dangerous if we decided to mess with them. Red, very danger. Very dangerous and dark, the deep red. Don't do it. And under build, we can build some residences. And we've already picked up all the rocks that were over there. It tells you very nicely when you, you exhaust an area. Ah, plenty of rocks just on the other side of the, ri the river. The river, the lake. It's only a few of us and we're armed with well, that's a child, but Bonak here, he has a sharp rock, a sharpened rock. Could use a storage tent at some point, but for now, our tents can hold some stuff. Let's tell him to go collect some wild berries. Sure, something here can be is collectible. Yeah, something on the ground over here, or so it said. Under the various metrics, we can see there are charts that we can graph. We see activity. It's one person just not wandering around. This small child. So for this, because there's extra children, we can go to sticks here and tell them up to two people. This way both ch children can go collect sticks. So residency, storage, production. We have a hearth. We could use a crafter, a place to make things. And a place to dry skins that we get. Shift click to get mo more down than one. Eh, four piles of sticks. One important thing you want to do is go to manage and limits and decide how much of everything in the game you actually want to be producing. Otherwise, they'll just keep going and going or going to these limits. So I'd like to bring food up to... a 100% of the population. Get six fish. I'd like to have a little extra. I like to have a little extra of everything. I feel like that's for all clothing, even though these are way out of our current range. Just knock all these up to 40. We got stones, flint, logs you get from chopping down trees, sticks, find them on the ground. For tools, be prepared for the population to grow. Nothing wrong with that. And that will give extra for... For purposes. Not unlimited animals. Let's do five of each when it comes time. Any extra animals that manage to get to come in to play the extra ones will be butchered for their meat and hide. There are a bunch of animals right here. 
However, we're armed with rocks and sticks. Let's not go mess with the bison. Instead, there is a single... However, on the other side is a bear. We might not want to do that. Three of us should be able to handle this and get away before the bear closes in. It is winter. Just keep an eye on that bear. Okay, he's not running in the direction of... Okay, he bolted away. I've lost track of where we are. Okay. It's hurt. Chase him down, Oxa. Oxa. It has 10 health left. We have nutrition, hydration, stamina. It's getting tired. And so is she. Good job. Now, if you, mi if you don't mind. She's gonna take the stick she found. Where is everyone? I need so, I need a volunteer. You guys are putting this together. Where was it? There. She's got a rock, so she can butcher it. Take your sharp rock. Get some raw skin, some raw meat, and some bones off of this guy. She's a little hungry. She's a little thirsty, a little tired. Ox is getting something to drink. Ox is a little chilly. But I'd rather you guys get to this before some other prey does. Some other predator does. Wooly rhino. A bear just ran through camp. As happens. They fight each other. Bear's only kinda hungry. Bears are terrifying. Bear is no longer hungry. Despite wearing his skin, his skin outfit, he's very cold. It's below freezing outside. No one finished building the skin dryer. You can set things to priorities.
There, now the raw skins can be dried over this rack, turned into a dry skin. So we have, here at the crafter, they can make various things. You can turn on v continuous production of things. So whenever we have skins, turn it into outfits. Harpoons for fishing, spears for fighting. General rocks. And if you turn those on to a continuous, they'll just go until they reach these predefined limits you've already set. And the second the next hut is up so we can we can have up to 9 people here. It's a long winter. Easy prey around. Wouldn't call that an easy prey, but. Four hundred health on these guys. Five hundred and forty on the adult. them, they won't bother us. Alright, and we have six knowledge. We can now use that to unlock something. Bones, slings, dogs, tanning, Spirituality. We want to go for food drying first. Make our food last a little longer. Put at least one of these on high priority. Saving food for later will be very important. All right, our storages are almost full. It's time to ask for a storage tent. A tent with stuff that you don't live in. It's just just a bunch of stuff. Hmm. Here in the Paleolithic era. Yeah, the tech tree split into six parts. You spend a good amount of time in each part. So I have 167% workload. I'm asking them to do things outside of the usual macro managing that's going on. Carving out some sticks. Bear. We attack them, they'll run towards the bear. We don't want that. Uh, 
However, single old goat should be able to handle that. fishing. Here in spring. Bringing sticks over one at a time. job. Bonnock. I can't signal these things to be picked up. Ah, Tarkoal's going to get it. He, it's fine. They plan for this. Putting together the dryer. Keep the meat off the ground, and it gets preserved longer. Hmm. A baby goat. Change my mind. Adult goat. Good job. Couple spears and we're good. Have the food chart here. We have not quite enough food for everyone, so going to need to do something about that. Yeah, let's unlock dogs. Now dogs will just slowly come over time to the settlement and help me protect it. In case something were to go horribly wrong. had a quick snack, as you do. Uh, here on the spiritual. dancing skulls. For our people we have we have a health bar, we have nutrition, hydration, they need to drink and eat. Temperature, it's summertime, so he took his shirt off. It is 80 degrees. Stamina. How sleepy he is. These are two words not the same. And their morale. Goes up when he doesn't have much to do. Goes up when he takes a moment to pray. Huh. 
We put quite the order on backlog here of things to do. Let's prioritize this one. Bears are still hanging out. Five mammoths. Can we team up with the bears and take down a mammoth? Skull pull is done. Someday. So there's six of us. We have eight skin outfits sitting in storage. So we have enough clothes to keep everyone warm during the summer, the winter. We have enough tools for everyone. We're in a good spot. Oh, our first dog. Just a puppy. Puppies, they don't need to be fed. You don't have to worry about them, dogs. They will get they will just kinda hang around, they'll drink. You don't have to worry about their temperature either. They're pretty self sustaining and they don't do offensive attacks. However, if something was to come into camp, they would attack it. single rhino an old rhino what if we got everyone together what if we ask everyone to come together they'll come back and they'll arm themselves and we'll go on the hunt three of us should be able to handle a rhino despite having only spears and rocks. Majestic beast. The woolly rhino. Here they come. She does not fear us. getting hurt. We did it. Marak was almost, Maralk was almost killed during this. But it's done. Ah, she has to go get a rock before she can before she can butcher it. She needs to go get a, get a sharp rock. Another one. I think they were friends. Sticks are always in high demand. Keep up the good work, children. Huh. Every now and then, people will just come on and join the join the group. And when they do, they'll immediately run in and grab the extra stuff I've been making. Every now and then, a trader will show up. And we'll have goods for services. Well, goods for goods. The commission here is... This is how much is worth. It's Leather is worth five... Making the trade value 8 because it takes pretty big commission off of anything.
They brought with them fish, some meat, leather. Yeah, no, nothing we need right now. We're good. Thanks. Old news. Second trader? Same trader. You can try a lot of mead on one rack. Flint will be much more useful when we're using that as the end of our stick. Right now we're just using the stick itself. In fact... Yeah, let's start to do that. Unlocking bone tools, we can use tools out of bone. Instead of harpoons, let's use bone harpoons. Let's just sharpen a bone. Instead of wood spears, what if we use bones and sticks? Where are you going? Ah, to collect the rest of that rhino. The rhino dropped a lot. They are degrading out in the sun here. Trader is very upset that we didn't buy anything. These are all full. Ah, because the we need to prioritize the storage tent. Things will just sit on the ground. We'll be able to do this once the skins are ready. How you doing, Emerald? He's doing good. He's recovered whole points of health here in the fall. Everything been collected. Just this one bone. There we go. Tasks are keeping up with our population. Managed to make a couple of bone harpoons already. Protein hoarding. And you get this nice little overview of your camp, your settlement. This bison wants to walk right into camp. Get it. Good job. Is anyone carrying a rock? You are. Yeah. Moralk. My good man. Now, if we look at our food chart, we have food. The fact that you are hungry is purely your fault. Either that or all of our food is currently tied up on the dryer. No, there's fish and berries over here. So I'm just going to tell him, go, go eat. I don't want to hear it. Go eat. I 
I mean, everything in this age costs only five. Yeah, let's go ahead and immediately obsolete bone tools with composite tools. For example, the flint spear equal to the bone spear, but we don't have to use up our bones for it. We can make an axe. We don't have any axes in production. And picks. So we'll let bone spears be a thing. Because we have our flint going to axes and picks. Can't make a knife, though. The only best knife we have is the sharp rock. We have no picks. It's on the to-do list. Don't worry. And that we have more people, we have more capacity for skins. Storage tent is up. Things will no longer have to sit on the ground. Don't like that there's raw meat in here. Winter resistance. Here we have no picks. Breaking rocks and mining, which we can do now. I think, yeah, this is asking for a pick. It's on the to-do list, it's fine. So there's a healthy to-do list. Bears. Almost lost someone taking out an old rhino. Where we look, bears. I heard we have no picks. He's making a spear, then he'll make a pick. Spears are good for hunting and fighting. Yeah, that's good. Hunting and fighting are practically the same thing. I had two people picking up sticks. It Sticks are very useful. I can now chop down trees now that we have axes being made. Let's clear this out. So we'll set up a work order to chop down all of these trees. Everyone in our immediate facility, vicinity, facility. Being, I would like a separate, a separate place to put logs from sticks. Just need someone to put these four sticks down in a square to designate this is where sticks go. Gosh. 
There, now logs are in this pile. Sticks are in that pile. I have no rocks. Once we have a pick, so someone will be able to start picking up these rocks. Workload is getting up there. Is anything here gonna? It's only temp. Is anything here temporary? Yeah, that's temporary. I only asked for a finite number of these. <laughs> As we approach the dead of winter. We have food. It's a lot of effort to pick up one rock. We can have up to nine people. This initial bunch can all be grouped around the hearth. And we could expand yeah, this ways. So many trees everywhere. We go after the baby rhino. There's a good chance Mama will get upset. Let the two of you go after this guy. The single goat. Nice shot. No one's going to get this guy. You don't have a stick. You don't have a rock. Does anyone have a rock? Yeah, you do. Looking good, guys. Everything's looking nice and healthy here. It's not continuous on that. Let's just throw down a work order for then. Rocks here. Right, you have, I have a work order for you. Fishing, collecting. Says there's something here to collect. Yeah, people are working. They're depleting as they go.
tree felling has begun. A whole log. Bears leaving on the right. Bears hanging out on the left. With all of these enemies in the area, sling making is definitely on the to-do list now. We can now make a sling. We can hurl rocks. Take one skin and turn it into two slings. At this point, you, I could use a second crafter. Designate half and half. But I'm in no rush. Our 10th rock. Everyone's doing pretty good. We are out of flint. Moralk is... He's collecting flint. It's fine. Gorgicall. Children can only carry one thing at a time. It gives them something to do. going to leave. I would like to send someone to butcher this goat. Okay, good. It says keep it below 150 and a little less. Or a little more. Our tenth log. Stay away, bears. I have no grievance with you. And everyone goes after to pick up the rest of everything he threw on the ground. Excellent. Because the people can carry up to three things. Storage is a bit of an issue. I can have up to 12 people. It's spring. You don't think it's a little chilly to be walking around topless. New humans. 10 out of 12. And that helps the task list. Workload goes down quite a bit when more people show up. Three dogs. Dog, dog, and dog. Six years old, nine years old, six years old. Sound the alarm. Right, 
Put away the alarm. It is time to hunt. Hunt the mama. It's the dinner bell. Yes. With this many humans throwing spears. We won't almost lose someone every time. Still 300 health in this guy. Pack of wolves. A dangerous situation to be in. Just moving on. Good, good, good. Shopman. Got anything for me? Log. A single leather. We don't know about leather yet. I'll take one. We have some bread. Bread takes a while to go bad. And what is this straw? Whatever it is, I'll take one. Fine trading, Karak. Uh, new humans. So it's time to unlock Tanning. The wolves are attacking. Marok has upset the wolf. Epic duel. Morocco has fallen. While well, we're all here, the dad took out Morocco. We'll take out the wife, too. Go collect Morocco's stuff. Our first fallen. When someone falls, they drop their stuff. To remember the dead. to remember in remembrance of Moralk. Well, that's gonna happen every time I mute the, mute the uh, audio. Oh, we've actually filled up all the skin dryer. We use a couple more of those. Put down an order for four more. And now for tanning. For tanning, what we want to do is we want to collect tannin agents. 
just bark you straight scrape off a tree bears go this way then you can only collect it during certain times of the year so I'm gonna put it up to say 50 most and a tannery we can take our raw skin and we can either turn it into a dry skin or turn it into leather. Production zone. Good day, single reindeer. Farewell, single reindeer. Never forget. Sound the alarm. Forget about this reindeer that has surely buggered off by now. Yes. He's going after Moralk. Our dogs were gonna come help. Everything's fine. And with the leather, we can now make leather outfits. When it's when in the summertime people don't want to wear skins, it's too warm. They'd rather wear something light, like leather. And leather's better for combat anyway than a, a bunch of bulky skins. So this is where we want a second crafter. Split up the workload. As the queue has gotten a little long there. Let's make the queue a little bit longer. Well, not there. Spirituality. What that does, that unlocks the next level of a totem. slings. One ninety. Although some of these are temporary build the building things. Food is good. Outfits are good.
We are collecting sticks all the way from up here when there are sticks just to the left. It keeps morale high, having the totem poles and the skull poles around. Dog is helping. The tanneries up. They will take dry skin and some tannin and turn it into leather. I do not see tannin on the to-do list. Did I not put it in a proper spot? I can get tannin right here at home. We can only collect tannin in the spring. Never mind. It is summer. We missed our shot for for missed our shot for leather this round. And wolves and reindeers. Bears and bison and goats, they all coincide down at the water and hole. A single rock. Punish this reindeer. Run straight through our camp. Thank you. Presumptuous of you. Now whatever you were doing, go ahead and get back to it. Someone will come over here and butcher it. They have yet to learn to fear us. Healthy supply of slings. Hey, Saya. How are you today? At this point, the storage hut's getting a little full. It might be time for a second one. Oh, I'm good. Beat one game and we've moved on to the next. Dawn of Man. Survival game set starting in the Paleolithic era. We've almost reached our population cap. We're feeding everyone just fine. We could use another another tent. Hmm, how do we want to lay out houses? Housing. Put the main t ones over here and then do kind of a sprawl around the lake.
I hear sounds. I heard a mammoth. Can we get in on that action? Maybe that was a bear. A wounded auroch. Someone, go do that. Sprawling around the lake would that would look kind of nice. It's kind of flat over here. This could kind of evolve into a production center. Apparently, we have no flint. There's seven more flint to be had up here. Someone just needs to come do it. There's flint to be had up here, so. Ah, someone got that Oroch. Good job. Ah, team effort. Moralk, Yerob, looking good. Always remember. The lost bone of a harpoon. Children, can you collect this? Thank you. Oh, that's a nice touch. It, it, it would be wrapped around your wrist or arm since you're using it to spear fish. No, that's just a sling. Or we could put the resident area, resident area. What is an upper? Article 13. Can't say I'm entirely familiar with the logistics of money law things. Yeah, slowly move this way and see how the sprawl goes. Clearing trees as we go. Yerob, if you're hungry, there is plenty of food. Good shot. Someone will be around to collect. Take advantage of this until they learn to fear us. Requiring an upload filter on the internet does not sound like an ideal way of doing it. Storage tent to us, sec the second is up. My 
and what mighty horns you have. Megaloceros. I'll bring our cap up to 18 once this is done. Workload's getting a little high. Going to need to wait till more people are here before we can expand the workload anymore. I say that, but I'm going to immediately move that into here. So clothing and slings in this one. Five in here, only three. So one, we'll move knives over here as well. By knives, I mean sharpened, sharpened pieces of flint. A blizzard. And if everyone's against this law, why is um, what is it the pot? What's the positive part of it? It is five degrees Fahrenheit. It is very, very cold right now. Everyone, get indoors. What is wrong with you? Child, get inside. You there, get, everyone, get indoors. Well, I'm assuming it makes the government money. You're only wearing leather. You're not even wearing skin outfit. Get, yeah, you're going to get it. Before you catch a death of cold. Still, let's get, get back inside. Protect copyright. I wonder how that would affect things. You people are going to be the death of yourselves. That's, that's a storage hut. You can't go in there. more than unfortunate. So he's losing health for being outside in the freezing, freezing cold. Negative 14 degrees Celsius. Blizzard is over. Winter is here. Call. Were you outside the entire, the entire blizzard? You, you crazy man! The pol so the political climate of the internet. Always, always a scary thing. Let's get the band together. We have a we have a bear to kill. Terrifying looking bear. That's how you hunt a bear. You run up to it and smack it with an axe. Tarkal is falling. Don't 
dog is helping. Tarkov fell. This brave man who did not even bring a sling or a spear just brought an axe and decided to go take out the bear. Okay, can someone go, I don't know, butcher the bear? Make Google pay for show for showing up in the search results. Shame to lose someone, but on the other hand, it's fewer mouths to feed. We are in need of flint. Lots of flint. We are already collecting that flint. There some more. you're done eating are you gonna come maybe butcher the bear where is it ah bear has been butchered good job everyone this flint is done man we are just pounding through flint all right that's the other one next one we're doing Some flint on the ground right here. One and two. Only at half capacity. There's room for growth. humans. Perfect. That's what even does it. We'd like to grow this way. So I'll just put down a standing order to slaughter all of these trees. Keeps the workload a little high, but we'll be better for it. A trader who brought some tannin. We'll take that since we can't. We can only get it one time a year. I'll take some flint too. What is this weird vegetable thing? Peas. What are peas? We will buy a pea and see what we think about it. You're so sleepy, ma'am. Just go take a nap.
a pretty good spot here in the Paleolithic era. Birth. Bonzor, our newborn baby boy. Back then, humans were much more useful when the, upon being born. Very useful. Good child. Mega with large rock. Long, long winters. Test loads calming down just a bit. Further human, Gornak. Yeah, settlement sprawl. Looks like it'll be going this way. Survive the winter. At some point, I'll tear down the original houses and have nice, even setups. Is it time? Well, he's being guarded. It's time. Now, bring all the boys to the yard. starts. There they come. Yes, it takes a village. The winter hunt. For taking down a mammoth, I suppose. Yeah, you can get a lot out of a mammoth. not time for a nap. You are very hungry. Good hunt, everyone. Much higher demand for tools than there is clothes and slings and rocks. Good 
could balance this a little better, but... Or even make a third crafter to make just half of these. It's fine. Survived a few winters. Slayed our first mammoth. Wolf attack. Attack. Good work. It's a good button to have. Yeah, we'll go finish up. This bear didn't eat all of it, so we'll take the rest. And we still have this stuff to collect. Including... So he had... The man who fell earlier, he left a sling behind. There's a lot of stuff to collect. You're getting to work on that. And everyone's still collecting all the meats. The bear is still in the area. Bear knows better. Bear saw us defeat the, the mammoth. We asserted our dominance over the bear. Everything here will go bad before we even get it back to camp. Oh good, someone grabbed it. The bear. Bari. Bari was right there. I butcher it, but I don't have a rock. Y'all are hungry. That is your fault. We have food, food abundant. To the point where our both of our storage tents are full. Morocco is dead. Let's put up another storage tent over here. By the crafters. Old girl. The adult female just came out of the 
walked through the lake. Bunch of them. You don't have a rock. Anyone here with a rock has a rock? The bear is gone. The bear has vanished. Moralk is dead. It's a good game. I'd recommend this for anyone who who is kind of entered in, into this kind of game. Next time, Mesolithic.